I think the cafe has always been a place for networking. All the intellectual writer, artists, security people actually use the space to meet up and talk about work and being like really progressive. There is demand for people to go out and enjoy themselves and have a social environment, but also a place to work. Sitting in a pub and doing your work is maybe not the most conducive environment, but going to a cafe where it's nice and warm and friendly and happening, that's a much nicer place for people to do their work. A lot of cafes where they're very in and out, you know, we need to turn tables and whatever, and I think they're starting to see the benefits of not doing that, not chasing people away. We don't expect anything from our laptop workers. We don't expect you to spend a certain amount of money. We don't expect you to stay for a minimum amount of time or maximum amount of time. I want people to be sitting, conversing, talking. We like to give the people that work here their own space. Like a home away from home, but just a little bit more focused. We love the idea of people coming at 9 o'clock in the morning and leaving at 6 p.m. and it happens a lot. You want to open your own business, a cafe is a good place to just go and sit and be, maybe taking phone calls, doing emails. The guy who owns Patty and Bun, the wonderful burger shop, sat here and set up his business in my business. You know, it's a networking space almost. It's like people talk to each other, customers talk to each other, start business together, or at least they keep each other's business. We have actually just launched our project, which is called The Blending Hour. So whether you're a creative, whether you're a musician, a blogger, a designer, we kind of hold events to bring those people into the cafe and share them with the community. People want to collaborate so much. So we'll have somebody working away thinking, oh, actually, that would be great for our next collaboration. When you want to, you know, get inspired or just want to see what people do, like what other people do, or just want to get out of your own environment, it's definitely good to come here, have a cup of coffee, and just listen to other people. Yeah, we are here to look after people. It's not just a coffee business, it's a hospitality business. We feed from people's energy. You know, we do very good coffee, we provide a brilliant space, but we also like our customers, and I think our customers like us back. We don't mind if you procrastinate. In fact, we're willing to help you and talk to you and like make sure the procrastination is at least a little bit fun. You'll always have your office, you'll always have that hub, but then people will, I think, as cafes start to kind of branch out and become even more kind of sophisticated, people want to explore something different. You do, and I think if that can come into your midweek meeting, then why not? <laughs>